Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to historic TCL Chinese Theater. Please welcome Los Angeles Mayor Eric Garcetti. To my friends from the legislature, from the city council, fellow mayors, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the entertainment capital of the world. And today, because of legislation that our great governor is about to sign, authored by our extraordinary assembly members, Mike Gatto, Raul Bocanegra, who are both here today, pushed over the finish line by Kevin DeLeon, our incoming state Senate President Pro Tem, and our speaker as well, who we appreciate. We're going to keep it that way, too. Please welcome assembly member Mike Gatto. The genesis of this legislation came at a town hall that I held two years ago when a father came up to me with tears in his eyes, relaying how he had been away from his family for the last 10 months filming in Georgia. He was not a big star, nor was he a studio executive. He was a middle class worker. You know, people often focus about this bill's effect on the industry, but this legislation has always been about preserving good jobs for working families which other states and other countries have been trying to steal away from us. You cannot assign a value on having a healthy middle class, anchoring our communities, and all of the intangibles that that provides, everything from stronger families to a better educated workforce in the long term. You know, I've received thousands of letters from people up and down the state, from real people, below the line employees. I even received letters from children like Tyler and Caleb Greenberg, who at age nine and 13 wrote about how hard it was to relocate because their dad couldn't find work in California. Folks, no one runs for office with the goal of having to help struggling local industry because no one wants our industries to struggle. The reality is that policymakers face the tough decision of doing something to combat the poaching from other states or doing nothing. And today with one stroke of the pen, California is doing something. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Governor Jerry Brown. Well, this is a great day for Hollywood, for California. So many have said, you know, what happened to California? Well, as you look around the world, look at Washington, look at uh, Europe, look at Asia, California is on the move. And Hollywood is a very important part of that. And we do it together. We do it together, not just one political party, uh, not just one group of people, but the coming together, the confluence of Republicans and Democrats, uh, politicians and movie executives, teamsters and stagehands. It's a really, it's a, it's a wonderful coming together that builds this powerful state. It's a golden state, but it's the home of the silver screen. It's the place of dreams. Ever since the gold rush, people have come from all over the world, and they'll still come. The stories you hear that we heard earlier today, hopefully those won't be repeated, and we will create thousands and tens, tens of thousands of jobs. But mark how we do it. It isn't just government. It isn't just people in business. It's not just a labor union. It's all of us working together with a big dream, a big vision, the vision of California, the place of opportunity. That's what we're investing in. And yes, it is taxpayers' money, but it's taxpayers' money going to build jobs for the future. So thank you, Hollywood. Thank you, California. Yes, we are back, and we are on the move.